What is going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. It is Wednesday, June 29th. Thanks for tuning in to Schmitty's MOB Picks on Guy Boston Sports. I'm your host, Ethan Schmidt. We got another full stacked slate in Major League Baseball. All 30 teams in action yet again is what we're going to see all summer long. I've got three of our favorite gameplays, our Yurfi of the day, and a couple of player props coming y'all's way today. I'm stoked. I think we're going to have a positive day, so let's get right to it. Appreciate y'all if you're tuning in for the first time and also our regulars. We love you guys. We are closing in on 11,000 subscribers, so please, huge, if you subscribe and smash that like button if you've been enjoying Schmitty's MLB picks. Special shout out to our ballers. We love you guys. Of course, we'll never stop letting you know. So grateful. Uh, giving us that extra support here for the grind and if you're new to the channel you can become a bala for just $2.99 a month you get a badge next to your name you get a bunch of exclusive emojis to use right here on YouTube we also have ballers only giveaways and the more ballers we get the more special things we can do for our ballers also brand new uh, this week we have got an MLB shop affiliate link so uh, this is super exciting and another way you can help support the channel if you guys want to do any uh, major league baseball gear shopping please go through our link it'll be in the description uh, and yeah if you want to get some new swag for your favorite team or maybe the hometown team here on the channel the Boston Red Sox get you some new gear uh, they have a free shipping promo going right now and like I said the link will be in the description for you guys going forward and I just gotta say guys look Hey, I am. I swear on my life, I'm doing everything I can to be winners here on Schmitty's MLB picks. You, I wouldn't be out here giving out BS plays, not trying to win for us. I put so much time and effort in, into this, and uh, you know, I had somebody comment, and I mean, bless him for being a viewer and a follower. But you know, he said you got to do better than 50/50. Look, guys, I'm out here giving free plays. I don't see nobody donating twenty dollars a week. Uh, to me or anything for this grind and I put in hours in each and every day and and I just love baseball and like I, I, I was honest with you guys from the beginning that this is my first year really handicapping baseball and and honestly this is the like in the last like actual year it's been my first year sports betting and like I have good knowledge of it and we're even going to start a betting series coming up but like but like guys come on like how how you expect me to go undefeated every day I'm just telling you right now nobody no handicapper out there is going undefeated every single day I'm doing my best lord knows but uh, yeah I just had to get that off my chest I love everyone out there supporting me and uh, respecting this grind but uh, just a quick recap after that from yesterday we actually had a winning positive positive day so take that we finished four and three over your 50 50 mark and uh, our year fee Marlins Cardinals did not come through and then Pirates money line oh my god it was 1-1 in the eighth and they had so many opportunities to get uh, the last out and then a two RBI double sealed the game and then the Red Sox team total over first five two and a half did not hit that's a huge womp womp uh yeah just uh i really thought the red sox would come uh come ready to play a lot earlier in that game they nearly won it after being down big and then our first win of the day the rangers money line cashes we didn't get too cute on that one and that was a beauty and then our player props both of them smashed on taco tuesday uh, astros jordan alvarez goes yard uh, in the seventh inning I believe it was and he smashed the over one and a half total bases I'm telling you guys every time we take a player prop they are hitting uh, taters out here gotta love it and then Philly starting pitcher Zach Wheeler over seven and a half strikeouts that was huge and then our hashtag ride of the day shout out to Brandon he gave us the Baltimore Seattle under four first five and that hit with soaring colors so we gotta love that, of course. Well, today we are right back at it. It is Winning Wednesday here on the channel. Jumping right in, my first play of the day. We have the Houston Astros at the New York Mets. 
and I tell you what guys I really wish I had taken the Astros yesterday it was gonna be one of my plays but today we are on the Houston Astros Justin Verlander going for the Houston Astros he's got a 2.22 ERA 9 and 3 on this season a 0.87 whip this guy's a monster and Verlander he it's like he he has spurts where he wins and then and then he'll have one bad loss but right now he is going to be on a winning streak because he really came back to life in his last outing uh, with a big win over the Yankees one of the best offensive lineups in the game as you guys know and so he is back to winning ways here and then taiwan walker I have him on my fantasy team i actually like taiwan six and two a 3.03 .03 era and a 1.21 whip but i think that the astros are just too much again today in this one and verlander is gonna have uh himself one of one of his typical justin verlander days and houston has been dominating this series of four and oh in their last four interleague games they're six and oh uh, in the last six meetings against the Mets. So I just really like taking the Astros here again. This offense is cooking, especially with Alvarez. Our second gameplay of the day, we have the Texas Rangers at the Kansas City Royals. And we were all over this one yesterday. And I think we are right back to it today. I really like Texas to get the sweep today. I'm taking them on the money line over the Kansas City Royals. Uh, Dane Dunning going for the Rangers. Rangers and he hasn't been too terrible this season um, and then uh, Zach Greinke on the other side for the Royals and I think that uh, Dane Dunning is just a better pitcher in this matchup if you want to play it safe I do like the Texas team total over in this game and the, the over total has moved up from nine to nine and a half of course looking at these two guys Dane Dunning one in five four point one seven ERA a 1.33 whip and Greinke one in four a 4.68 ERA and a 1.27 whip so not the greatest pitching matchup but I think uh, Dunning has been figuring it out here lately and I just really like the Rangers in this spot they've been owning the Royals so our final gameplay of the day we have the Atlanta Braves at the Philadelphia Phillies and this one Kyle Wright going on the mound the righty and then Ranger Suarez the lefty for Philadelphia and uh, Ranger Suarez has not really been it for Philly in his last outing against the Braves he got torched and then Kyle Wright I really like Kyle Wright I've been backing him all season long and I just really like what he might be able to do here against the Phillies today might even consider taking Kyle Wright uh, his strikeout total, um, but this this uh, this line has been moving in the direction of the Braves. Kyle Wright eight and four, three point one eight ERA, a one point one six WHIP. Suarez six and four, a four point two three ERA and a one point four eight WHIP. I'm taking the Braves first five run line here. Uh, that means that the Braves are going to be up by one after five innings. And I think that's the best play in this game. Braves are 5-0 and in their last uh, five Wednesday games, 10-2 uh, and in their last 12 road games. And then, uh, yeah, the, Bra the Braves were able to pull it out yesterday. And this Phillies lineup is not the same without Bryce Harper. And the Atlanta bats are cooking. My boy Travis Darno with another big day yesterday. So that's what I like. It is time for our Yurfi play of the day. You guys know that we have switched it up here on Schmitty's MLB picks. And today there's some good options. I was looking at the Athletics Yankees because the Yankees always put up a first inning run. And then uh, the Cubs and the Reds because uh, the Cubs are one of the best teams in the league in putting up a first inning run. But I think today we are going to take Dodgers Rockies. Uh, we got Urias and Marquez on the mound. And I just really have a feeling about this one. You guys know, like, if, if it just feels like something's going to happen, I think the Dodgers do get back at the Rockies today. And I could see them getting up a first inning run here today. The Dodgers are ninth in the league in first inning runs a game. And on the road, they're even doing better 61% of the time. And then the Rockies 
are at uh, 13th in the league and at home they're putting up a first inning around 75 percent of the time so i really like this year if you play it i'm taking it in dodgers rockies our player props for the day i got two for you guys our batter prop we are taking the yankees aaron judge over one and a half total bases i he's just hitting the nuke today i feel it uh he's been a little bit dry since his uh walk off hit and uh that honestly i i can't remember when uh that was but that was like a few games ago and aaron judge is due today so i just really like him uh getting the over one and a half total bases today and then our pitcher prop we are going with shohei otani i would ride with this man to the depths of hell uh he is a monster um we actually I was telling you guys the last time he pitched, it was crazy uh, taking the live line and he hit 13 strikeouts. So that was just unbelievable. And today the line is at six and a half. I feel like we're going to be stealing today. Otani just needs seven strikeouts for us to clear today. So I really like this play. Yeah, guys, sorry I wasn't able to really jump in too deep today. And, and uh, that's just really been the thing is that uh, I'm a working man now. My schedule is still getting figured out, but I appreciate everyone bearing with me as we continue forward. Wrapping up my second month here on the channel. And I really appreciate all of you, of course. You can follow me on Twitter at the Ethan Schmitz, where I post the final plays each and every day for Schmitty's MLB picks. And you can also keep up with my latest works in sports media. If you haven't, please like, subscribe, share this video. We're trying to reach everyone we can. I'm Ethan Schmidt. We'll see you tomorrow. Peace out.